Boy says he got pencil stuck in his ear. Turns out to be much stranger. An English boy went to a doctor with his grandmother after he claimed he snapped a pencil inside his ear a week earlier. However, when a doctor went to examine him, it was more unusual. Lewis King, according to a doctor in a BBC video report, said it was even more serious than expected. Kids are always getting up to some sort of mischief, but Lewis King managed to take that to the next level. While playing around, he managed to get something lodged up in his ear. And he waited an entire week before he told his mother about it. Apparently, Lewis had been playing around with a pencil when he'd stuck it in his ear and it broke off, leaving a small piece of it inside. So, for one week, he had a foreign object stuck in his ear. Yikes! Lewis was rushed to a hospital where a doctor in the emergency room looked him over and searched in his ear to see what it was. Lewis described the pencil, saying it was only a very small piece. Understandably, the doctor was worried and rushed to get the item removed because leaving it in for too long could eventually cause infections and even deafness. But as the doctor dug into his ear, he realized that Lewis had been lying about what exactly got stuck in his ear, and the real culprit was pretty unbelievable. When he pulled it out, the doctor even noticed that Lewis's eardrum had completely disappeared. Luckily, eardrums regrow over time, and this should be back to normal within six weeks. Instead of finding a pencil fragment, the doctor found a watch battery. It looks more like a watch battery to me, the doctor said to him. The doctor then informed King that I can't see your eardrum, which means that it's gone. The watch battery, he said, made a hole in it, and he said the eardrum will grow back naturally over the next six weeks. It's still not clear how the boy got the battery in his ear or confused it with a pencil. The fact that he said that it was a pencil and it turned out to be a watch battery, that's pretty bizarre, the doctor stated. The main danger of him putting things inside your ear is that you can't see what you're doing and could potentially cause significant harm," said Dr. David Stutz with the University of Michigan on its website. If the battery had not been removed, it could have caused hearing loss, pain, and infection. In the end, Lewis fully recovered and learned not to stick anything in his ears again. It's still unknown how or why he decided to hide a watch battery in his ear, but that's just kids for you. Do you or your kids ever do anything like this? Let us know.